the wait is over. There are few bigger days on the football calendar than Champions League final day. Fans are beginning to pour into the stadium and the tension is palpable. It's Manchester City, they face Manchester United and it's live on EA TV. Well, there's nothing quite like this occasion. Welcome to the UEFA Champions League final. The best two teams in Europe this season preparing to go head-to-head -head for the crowd. This is Derek Ray in the commentary position, and I'm joined as always on these big occasions by Stuart Robson. It is Manchester City versus Manchester United. Well, Derek, this is magnificent. The atmosphere inside this stadium is electric. Let's just hope the tension doesn't affect the players. It shouldn't do. Just look at the quality down there. starting 11 for Manchester City Ederson between the posts Manuel Akanji plays with Kyle Walker as fullbacks Kevin De Bruyne starts alongside Rodri in the centre of midfield and leading the line today is Erling Haaland the team Manchester United will go with David De Gea between the posts Rafael Varane plays with Victor Lindelof in central defence Christian Eriksen starts with Casemiro in the centre of the pitch and the lead striker today is Anthony Martial And they get the ball rolling in the Champions League final. We're about to find out who will be crowned club kings of Europe. And on the back of that particular challenge, will the referee let the matter rest there? So we have an early booking here to report, Stuart. Yeah, I think the referee's absolutely right. He's just making it clear to all the players out there, he's not going to take any messing about here. an effective clearance given away by City good use of advantage in United's favour well high and more than a bit hopeful Walker Holland Holland determined defending well we have to say Stuart respect and admiration grows for Kevin De Bruyne with each passing year so many attributes what are you looking for from him in this game well, he's such a natural finisher. He has everything a good goal scorer needs. Composure, technique and awareness. He will certainly need to be tightly marked today. De Bruyne. Well, he's lost the ball. 
And that's not what you want to be doing when you've already been booked. And it is the case that two yellows equal a red. Well, that was always going to happen. He just couldn't contain himself, could he? on target but it was never going to trouble the keeper Riyad Mahrez and disappointing that it's gone out of play and getting in there to intercept Lindelof And a fine tackle. Good technique displayed. Terrific piece of anticipation. Gundogan. Couldn't hang on to the ball. Aaron Juan Bisaka. Now Casemiro. Bruno Fernandes. Well, they would have been disappointed had he spilled that one. Mares. Holland. Manchester United recovering possession well. This might be ideal for the counter. Referees are rightly praised for giving advantage, but when there is no advantage, it has to be a free kick. Well, he'll be thanking his lucky stars that the referee settled for a verbal warning rather than a booking. United doing well to regain possession. Martial. Now well, they've given him too much space. And that'll be a United throw. Casemiro. Bruno Fernandes has it. Potentially freedom for United on the flank. Mares. Good looking cross. It's still alive. Well, good defending, clattered out of there. Well, City will count themselves unlucky not to have taken the lead there because that was a brilliant piece of goalkeeping. What a stop that was. City did well to win it back. Gundogan. And in with a real chance. And they've scored! First goal in this season's UEFA Champions League final. Well, let's take another look. And you have to say the defending is so poor. That's far too easy. The keeper had no chance there.
ball rolling again with the score line standing at 1 0. Holland. Counter attacking, very much an option. the measure of his man but he was on his toes to win the ball back the brain it must be misfiring completely yeah he's gone for power but the contact was never right it's a poor effort really well it's not been great from City so far and as you can see, they just haven't created enough going forward. Unless they can up the tempo, I can't see that changing. Mares. Makes the move to the inside. It's got to be! And there it is! A two-goal cushion now! And just look at these fans! The trophy coming their way! Sure! Well, here it is again. He goes past his marker so easily with just a drop of the shoulder. And the finish is just as good. That's an excellent goal. Back underway with the scoreline standing at 2 0. Manchester United keep the ball, advantage. Short. Christian Eriksen now. The first half here comes to an end. Into the second half then in this battle for Champions League glory. Really bright looking attack. Chance to finish. Well, really fine goalkeeping. Good diving stop. And played short. And Mares inside. And that was simply miles off target. Well, I think he's right to go for power, but he's made the wrong connection. And it's really poor technique in the end. Anthony. Bruno Fernandes has it. And unable to keep possession. Casemiro. Eriksen. Moving it forward. But quick thinking defensively. Playing advantage here. United keep it. Well, the fact of the matter is sometimes there is no advantage. And that was the view of the referee. Well, the referee has taken his name and they've got to be careful that they don't lose the plot here. Well, Derek, they've got to stay calm. They've just lost their composure here.
Top class defending. Has a go. What a save. Short corner favourite. Deep delivery. Well, when it left the boot, I thought it might have a chance of fooling the keeper, but it didn't. Good pressure to win the ball back high up the pitch. Will he finish? And oh, it's in! We cannot declare this contest over. They still believe. Well, here's the replay. Watch how he goes past his man with such ease. And it's just a change of pace. But there's still plenty to do from here. He hits it so well, though. Lots of pace, lots of power, and the keeper just can't react in time. It's a great strike. So back underway at 2-1. Tight contest here. Really good attacking play. Good use of advantage in United's favour. Committed challenge. Can they create something from here? Well, nothing comes of it. It looked promising. Casimiro. And an astute piece of defending. And a throw in here for United. Well, the referee let it go initially, but now he goes back and cautions him, Stuart. Yeah, it's a good bit of refereeing. He tried to let the play continue, and then he came back for the booking. Here's a change for Manchester United. Juan Bisaka. Very quick thinking there. Decent position this for United to find themselves in. And a bad pass it was. Manchester United keep the ball. Advantage. Anthony. Fernandes. Can someone get on the end of this? Well, not cleared away completely. He's blocked it. Poor pass. Advantage, Manchester United. Well, sometimes advantage just doesn't work out. And the referee has awarded a free kick now. Well, it's always at the discretion of the referee, in this case, opting not to book him. This is looking threatening. Oh, he's left his marker for dead. Can he find the net? Superb block. Wonderful challenge and a throw-in coming up. Now well, they no longer have the ball. Could be a chance to break here. Well, they seem to be onto something positive, but it faded away. 
It's a fine United move in the making. A well, disappointing end to the move. Rashford. And Grealish. He's lost it. Fernandes. Might be able to get in behind the defence. Manchester United know they've got to get on the front foot with time the enemy. Not accurate enough from Gundogan. Oh, great attacking play. Rashford! Oh, incredible save, and he snuffed out the danger. Well, this late corner could represent the last chance to equalise. Playing it in. And did his job defensively. Another corner. Ericsson. Terrific block. And support available. This could level it. But denied by the keeper. And at this late stage in the proceedings, it could be highly significant. Well, it could be a huge moment, Derek. So little time left now. So the corner played into the box. That's time to get the shot off. And hit with ferocity. It was close, but not quite good enough. Dicing with danger. Oh, marvellous save. Great goalkeeping. Time really is of the essence. What can they do from this situation? <laughs> Trying to deliver it accurately. He's given it away. Well shown inside, takes the shot, well not a million miles away from the equaliser. Well he couldn't quite get it on target, but at least they're making chances now. Grealish an unforced error you've got to say Casemiro well, time is against them they have work to do oh a smart stop trying to pick out a teammate will they make it count well, not an effort for his own personal scrapbook. And there it is, full-time Manchester City Champions League winners. Well, just look at the emotions out there. Joy and relief on one side, despair and heartache on the other. But we've got the right winners here. They fully deserved it on the night. For these players, well, it's the night of their lives. And they're determined to enjoy every millisecond. Well, they have to make the most of this, don't they? It's a great feat. What an achievement from them. Well, they don't need to be reminded about what comes next. It's the presentation of the coveted Champions League trophy. Well, there's some tired players out there, but what you can be sure of, they'll find some energy when they get their hands on the trophy. They'll be going mad in the next few moments. The Champions League winners, Manchester City. 
Well, this is what they wanted. What a moment for these players. They've worked so hard to win this trophy. They've been fantastic. And you can feel the emotion. It's natural to reflect on this final, but so much hard work has gone into the entire campaign. Memories, memories. What would a celebration be without the chance to enjoy it with your own supporters? Well, these fans have certainly played their part, haven't they? They'll savour these moments. They've travelled far and wide to follow their team. They're loving every minute of this, and why not? They deserve it. A performance of fire as well as ice. They held their nerve when that was necessary. And these celebrations will run long into the night. Well, these are the moments they have to make the most of. It doesn't happen very often, does it? These will be photos to cherish for years to come. Brilliant stuff. The Champions League victors, Manchester City.